Hey guys, DC Network here, coming at you with another video. So given that Cartoon Network never had an upfront this year, and they never really gave us any updates on all of these upcoming series for the channel, many people were looking towards San Diego Comic Con as the place for the Cartoon Network to reveal new information on their upcoming shows and movies, and San Diego Comic Con came and went a few weeks ago, and they really didn't have much of a presence there at all. The only piece of information that we got got from San Diego Comic Con regarding an upcoming Cartoon Network original series is that the heroic quest of the Valiant Prince Ivando got a first look trailer and got a coming soon release date or window and that's pretty much it. They didn't mention the Amazing World of Gumball movie, they didn't mention Unicorn Warriors Eternal, they didn't mention the Total Drama Island revival, the only thing they mentioned was the Valiant Prince Ivando premiere. And again, they just said it was coming soon, so it's not exactly like there's a lot of clarity there. Cartoon Network says something is coming soon, and it could be 3-4 months away, so yeah. What exactly has been going on this year over at Cartoon Network that they just haven't talked about any of their upcoming series at all whatsoever? Are these shows even coming? Are they just, you know, a figment of our imaginations that we think they exist, but in reality they don't? What exactly is happening here? because Cartoon Network is continuing to announce new shows like the new Powerpuff Girls reboot and the Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends prequel show, but they're just not giving us updates on any of the series that they announced before. So what exactly is going on? And I think probably one of the bigger factors as to why there's been no upfront this year and there's no updates on a lot of these series is because of the Warner Discovery merger. I think that that played a big role in the lack of announcements for this year because if we look at what's happening, Happening behind the scenes a lot of shows have been canceled I talked about this recently in a video that a lot of shows are being canceled there are going to be cuts to animations I'll leave a card above to that video if you want to hear me go in detail on that topic but the reason why we haven't heard about any series this year is number one some of them have probably been canceled by the new executives and number two the others just aren't ready to be shown off yet which number one if the series are being canceled in my opinion Cartoon Network owes it to its fans to let them know hey yeah this show's been canceled the new total drama revival it's not happening anymore the new gumball movie it's not happening anymore if something's not happening they should tell us up front be upfront and transparent with us because a lot of these show cancellations we're finding out about them through the creators on twitter cartoon network's not saying anything warner brothers they're not saying anything it's just the creators are saying hey yeah our show got canceled we're really sad about it you know what can we do we wish it wasn't this wasn't the case but you know it is what it is cartoon network just doesn't speak on any of these series and neither does Warner Brothers at all in general. They just don't like to be transparent with the fans. And number two, speaking of transparency, if a show isn't ready to be shown off yet, it'd be nice to have an update saying, yeah, we're still working on it. It's going well. It's it's on track for our targeted release date in the future. We ask you to be patient with us. We hope you're looking forward to these series because they need a little bit more time to develop. But instead, we're left wondering, hey, has this show been canceled? Hey, is Mao Mao Hills or Pure Heart ever coming back? Is Elliot from Earth ever coming back? What's happening to all these series? There's no answer to our questions because Cartoon Network just doesn't want to say anything. And the last thing I'll say is, you know, a little bit of icing on the cake is recently I discussed how Cartoon Network hasn't really said anything about their 30th anniversary other than a few tweets on their Twitter handle. What, what I think is even more interesting is it's the 30th anniversary and not only are they not really doing anything to celebrate it for the whole year, they haven't really talked about it much at all. But on top of that, they're not even doing anything with the current Cartoon Cartoon Network. It's as if Cartoon Network as a brand doesn't really exist anymore. They have, I saw this tweet, my friend sent me a text message with a tweet saying, Cartoon Network's current shows, Teen Titans Go, We Baby Bears, and The Amazing World of Gumball or Total Drama Rama, something like that. And it's very much true. Out of all the shows that Cartoon Network has in its portfolio, they really only have three series right now that are actively airing new episodes, you know, on a semi-consistent basis, if we can even call it that. So Cartoon Network, not only is it their 30th anniversary and they haven't really started to celebrate it yet, they're not even doing anything with the current channel itself. It's as if the channel doesn't really exist anymore other than airing reruns of Teen Titans going the Amazing World of Gumball. Like, yeah, I know there's some Victor and Valentino episodes coming, 
but it's only for one week and then that show's probably going to disappear again for more months to come and we're not going to hear about it we're not going to know what's happening with it because cartoon network just doesn't like to say anything all in all i really don't understand what is happening over at cartoon network like i understand they're in a period of transition with the warner brothers discovery merger but they still need to be semi-transparent with the fans just to be like hey these shows are still coming hey these shows have been canceled hey season two of elliot from earth is never coming or my my here's a pure heart and Instead, we were just left in the dark wondering, and I feel like San Diego Comic-Con was definitely the place for them to give us these updates since Cartoon Network never had an upfront this year and was not even at the Warner Brothers Discovery upfront. Instead, they said nothing, they showed us a little bit of the Valiant Prince Ivan Doe, and they said it's coming soon, and everything else that's in the pipeline? Is it still coming this year? Are they even coming at all? Who knows? And we're probably not gonna know for a long time, because for Cartoon Network, their MO is to just let us sit and wait and not tell us anything about it which that's a great way to keep the fans interested cartoon network anyways let me know in the comment section below if you guys are surprised that there was nothing besides the heroic quest of the valiant prince ivando at san diego comic-con a few weeks back thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time